Hey everyone, this is Ed Yunet coming to you here on Veterans Day and I wanted to put together this video with some uh, pictures of a book that my grandmother put together during World War II for my mom. See, my mom was born July 17, 1944. Um, Ellen Beck was her maiden name, but it was Ellen Yunet. And the funny thing was is that she didn't see my grandfather, Edward Martin Beck, until she was 16 months old. So my grandmother put this scrapbook together for her to keep a chronological um, a scrapbook of everything that happened during the war while her father, my grandfather, Edward Martin Beck, was away. And the, some of the things that he, he had to put up with and that he dealt with in the war was just unbelievable. Um, it's... it's, it's um, more crazy than any movie you've ever seen, but um, he didn't like to talk about it a lot, really at all. So, but um, these are some amazing pictures of some of the articles that my grandmother saved. Um, there's probably about another 15 or 20 pages, but my grandmother's name was Mary Ellen Beck, and you'll see some letters. There's some letters and some notes in here addressed to her from him, from my grandfather Edward Martin Beck. Um, one of the funny thing things was is that you'll see here there's a telegram coming up here a picture of it that he was wounded in action um, on February 7th 1945 and it took him a month to get a telegram to my grandmother that um, he was hurt um, he was wounded he was shot but he was okay he, he actually stayed um, in, in and, and finished his tour I guess is what, what, what they called it back then but um, anyway, this is just a, a living piece of history that isn't just a stuffy history book, but something that my grandmother put together with her own two hands. I don't know how many years ago it's been. Was it 60, 60 something years ago? But um, anyway, thank you very much to all the veterans and all the sacrifices that they put up with, and they uh, they sacrificed for us, for our freedom, for everything that we have, because without them, we would really we really wouldn't have the freedoms that we have. So. Anyway, God bless America, God bless all of our veterans, and thanks for watching.